eight. Well, I just wanted to let you know that my documentation came today and I'm going to show you what I got. Starting off with, it came, it's from the Universal Life Church Ministry, see? I don't know if you can see it because you know, I'm going to have to reverse this, but it came. I got these things I'm going to show you. Let me just fix this, sorry. I got a clergy card. See, can you see it? It says clergy. Clergy card. That's one. Actually, I got two. I got one in black and one in white. And I'm going to get some different ones because um, in the future, I would like to perform other ceremonies for um, other types of weddings. So I want to keep them open, you know. So I want to get that. And I have my card. I don't know where I'm looking at on these things. I never do this right, but I do. I'm very happy. It's called the Universal Life Church Ministries. This is the credentials of ministry. This is to certify that the. Oh, I said it wrong. The bearer hereof on this day, the 23rd of April. On the year 2023, Anna Otano Fergali is ordained by the Universal Life Church Ministries. Oh, look, look. Can you see that? Look. Ah, that I'm very happy about this. Inside this, I have a marriage certificate for the people that I'm going to marry to be renamed later on because that's their business and they're not ready to share that yet. And I have, uh, it gives you a little booklet that shows you how you perform the ceremony. It gives you options and it's really nice. Very, very nice. They give you the marriage certificate that you're going to be giving to the people that you're going to be marrying. It's so pretty. Look. Look how nice this is. And it's, a, it's the real deal. I'm not playing, guys. Look. A real certificate of marriage, see? And I'm going to be doing that. And see, you can't see who it is because I made sure to leave it blank because some of y'all are kind of nosy and want to know everything. And I can't tell you. But it's in here. And um, the book, I'm trying to see, did I put it away? Here it is. No. The book is called By the Power Vested in You. And see? And it gives me all the little guidelines and stuff like that and certain things that I can say at the ceremony because um I would like to be able to officiate weddings for all people across the spectrum. I, I'm open-minded that way. I don't care who you love as long as you love. So this is the book and it's very, very nice. I mean, very nice. And I know um what states have what laws and you have to each state, you have to check to see what the criteria is for the people to get married in. So I have, I did that too. I'm very proud of myself because I did this. I did this. And um, I'm going to really, I'm going to look into more things that I want to do. I'm going to take a couple of courses. I take my stuff seriously. I don't play with stuff like that, especially things that have to do with um, people's relationships between themselves and my relationship between me and God. So I don't play with that. So yes, I am ordained. Yes, yes, yes. I'm not going to go around preaching in people's churches and stuff like that because we both know that can't happen. But I am a happy camper, so I just wanted to share with y'all. I got it, I got it, I got it. Oh, and I'm going to be doing my nails later. Yes, yes, yes. Don't worry about all of that. And I have my little cross and, you know, my evil eye protection as usual. This is a box over here that I have. I don't know if y'all can see it, but it's a box of some of my summer color nail polishes that just came in. I'm very happy about that, so I'll be doing that later on. I just wanted to let y'all know what came and how happy I am. And um, and you'll see my eyes going from here to there because I'm still trying to work this out. A decade later, I still can't figure out how to do a daggone video, but I am trying. And at this moment, I am feeling blessed and highly favored. You know, just because you have an illness doesn't mean that the illness has you, so you don't let it win. Find something that makes you